while I was going through cancer, I was so fixated on appearance, like not having hair, not having eyelashes, not having eyebrows. I was so fixated on it. And I really wish I could go back and be like, it's not what it's about. Like you can be a fighter and you can get whatever you want. I was bald when I created my gift and no one saw me. And the more and more power I got towards getting something I wanted with MedGift, the more I stepped out, the more I put the bandana on and went into meetings. Because that's powerful. You go to a, a meeting with somebody who can help you with no hair, they know you're serious. Because no one wants to walk out the door with no hair. <laughs> so being in charge of who you are, regardless of outward appearances, is beautiful. And it took me having to lose it all to realize that. I always was Miss, you know, the Southerner. I got to have big hair. I got to be curled. Like, it has to be perfect. I got to look perfect. And beauty is imperfection. Like, beauty is in imperfection. I wouldn't be me without having, you know, some wig heads in my drawer. Like, that would be weird. I don't want to get rid of them because I kind of like them there. Those kind of things will always make you more beautiful and also help get your goal and get what you want across. There's so many women in the world. There's so many beautiful women of every different shape, size, and whatever. The more you can show someone else that looks like you that, hey, I'm doing it, you can do it too, is magical.